bombs came gift-wrapped with expletive-filled notes threatening mass death and demanding money. Two homemade explosives were delivered to a pair of Aspen banks. Two more were found abandoned in a downtown alley. They were found to contain improvised incendiary devices made of gasoline and containing what appeared to be cell phone actuators and anti-tamper devices. A New Year's Eve evacuation was ordered and the popular ski resort town was emptied as police searched for a lone suspect photographed by a bank security camera. Police identified the image immediately as that of 72-year-old James Blanning, a mentally troubled local man who in 1994 had threatened a bizarre public suicide. Basically uh, set himself up on one of the roofs of the courthouse with a rope around his neck, threatening to hang himself and making some, making some other threats against the community. Police quickly disabled the four bombs, but the notes left behind chillingly warned there is also a fifth firecracker hidden in a high-end watering hole that we will remove after we know for sure all has gone well. No fifth bomb was ever found, and the scare which forced the cancellation of all of Aspen's New Year's Eve celebrations ended very early this morning when police found Blanning in his car, dead of one self-inflicted gunshot. Police say his motive was clearly money, and they're certain that he acted alone. Jeff? Bob Moore in Washington. Bob, thank you.